Welcome to this virtual open day presentation for MSc Digital Health. Our department is the Department of Computing and Informatics. And we have over 40 full time faculty members and five demonstrators who provide additional support. Our lecturers and professors have diverse backgrounds and excellent links with the industry. They are research active and use industrial and professional practice research case studies and projects in their teaching. We focus on student-centered learning and apply technical skills to solve problems. Bournemouth University has investment areas. These include animation, simulation and visualization, medical science, sustainability, low carbon technology, material science, and also assistive technology. The MSc in digital health aligns well with these investment areas, preparing a workforce to contribute to such areas. We want to develop critically informed, agile, and resourceful graduates who have a critical understanding of advanced theoretical knowledge, methods, and concepts of relevant digital health technologies that is needed to support the healthcare and social care services, products, and capabilities. We want to equip students with specialized technical knowledge and practical skills to take a professional approach to the planning, design, and management of digital health products to address real-world health care and also social care problems. We want you to have desired transferable and professional skills to widen your employment prospects through relevant digital health practices. We want you to have advanced research skills to carry out research to develop new or improve digital health solutions using a broad range of methods, tools and technologies as an effective independent researcher. We want to make sure that you're prepared to adapt to future changes in digital health in the healthcare and social care context through a comprehensive understanding of fundamental theories and also current best practices that you could utilize. I would like to give you a quick overview of the course structure. We have two semesters. In the first semester, we have two core units. Research methods for health and social care, and also foundations of health information systems. This MSc is delivered cross faculty. So, our colleagues from Faculty of Health and Social Science will deliver the research methods for health and social care unit. We also have two optional units in the first semester data management and blockchain and digital futures. Moving on to semester two. You will study two core units, human-centered design and also integrated digital healthcare project. The optional units are persuasive technologies and behavioral change and smart systems. At the end of completing the six units, the four core units and two optional units across two semesters, you will undertake an individual master's project. Placement year is optional. We have very good links with industry where you could apply your skills, gain experience and start earning. I've listed some prospective roles, future jobs. So you could become designers, health system and service designers responsible for designing healthcare systems. You could move into the role of a data analyst specializing in health and um, health and care decision making. You could become an application developer 
or a system developing digital health. Another role is information governance manager, who will be responsible for managing data and health information systems. You could move into the field of human computer interaction, human computer interaction user experience. You could become a user experience consultant, which is also referred to as a UX consultant and practitioner, and contribute to the designing of digital health solutions. Clinical information manager is another role that you could take for creating health systems to support clinical decision making. Our undergraduate and postgraduate students, they have very good placement experiences. You will notice some excellent known company names here, including IBM, Microsoft, Intel, JP Morgan. We have a very active computing and cybersecurity society driven by students for students. We have comp competitions. We have collaborative projects across programs. So some of the UNIS modules you will attend is delivered across programs. So you will engage with students from other programs. We do conduct research together with our students leading to joint publications with potential industrial clients. You will get a chance to engage in such activities, including participating in industrial and academic conferences. You can also join a research group and collaborate with postgraduate research students. We have a 24-7 computing student zone available to all of our students. These are supported six hours a day by staff. We also have dedicated lab spaces for our master's students. Let me take you through some of our specific facilities, which align well with the research groups that we have. These include the dedicated development lab, where we have virtual machines and Linux. The cybersecurity facility that we have, you could, you could have simulations, simulations of cyber attacks on large enterprise networks. We have the Open Innovation Lab. We have IoT devices that you could experiment with. We have a dedicated networking lab with Cisco routers and switches. As I mentioned, all of these labs align really well with our research groups where uh, that you could uh, contribute to. Bournemouth is located on the south coast between the Jurassic Coast to the west and New Forest to the east. The town has seven miles of sandy beaches and excellent attractions with an amazing social life. I'm sure you will enjoy your time here. What we expect from you is engagement and creativity. By creativity, I'm referring to, for example, developing a high fidelity prototype, improving business processes, or solving a problem, solving a digital health problem for a client. We hope that you will have a passion for learning. Studying is a rewarding full-time job, and you can get a lot out of it. Please do visit our website if you want to find more about the course, including the unit descriptions. You could find the web address, the URL on this slide. Thank you. We look forward to welcoming you soon.